New tonight, a heated confrontation caught on camera, and the star of the show is the sheriff in Todd County, Kentucky, just across the Tennessee-Kentucky line from Clarksville. Fox 17 News' Amanda Chen tonight talking with the man who says the sheriff threatened him before busting his lip. If you look on the Todd County Sheriff's website, it says its mission is to enforce the law fairly and defend the rights of all. But this elected official is under fire and community members want him to be held accountable. Well, there's a little spot down to the creek where I take my dog. Adam Weatherford is a quiet man who likes to keep to himself and stay away from trouble. So that's why this heated confrontation on Weatherford's property back in May. Don't you ever come up there to the flag. Confuses him to this day. I got your record. Weatherford says that's Todd County Sheriff Tracy White threatening him on his own doorstep. And he says the sheriff stepped way out of his lane. He complained to the Kentucky State Police, who eventually passed the investigation to the Logan County attorney. The county attorney there tells Fox 17 his office did receive a complaint against Tracy White from this May incident. Because I'm going to get your another way, buddy. And retaliatory stop. You can do whatever the f you want to do. You can do whatever you want to do. That's when Weatherford says things turned physical. For the sheriff seemingly grabs Weatherford's phone and claims the sheriff busted his lip. Get off my property. Get off my property. Get off my property. Because you are hurting minors on four wheelers with a. Oh, they, they can't, you can't get off my property. So, what led to this confrontation? Weatherford says he chased off some boys on dirt bikes, causing problems at a creek after he says the boys threatened to run over his dog back in February. Now, you've been down there, you've, you've hit. One of my nephew's friends. If I would have hit somebody, I'd have done been in jail, big no, boy. Well, I'm gonna tell you, it's gonna get worse than that if you ever do it again. <laughs> you don't even you don't even know if I did or not. Oh, you yes, don't even do. know. You've done nothing. You've never put hands on anyone or anything like never that. Never threatened one of the boys. Never did anything. Never been close enough. I mean, to hit one of them. I mean, they wanted to fight several times, but I'm not gonna entertain that. Their kids, you know. I mean, Weatherford says he's still waiting for answers from the report he filed with the Kentucky State Police. I spoke with Sheriff White on the phone. At the time I spoke with him, he told me he hadn't seen the video and had no comment. Several days later, I went to the Todd County Sheriff's Office. And we just wanted to give him an opportunity to answer a few questions if he wants to. Staff members told me he was not in the office but would pass along my request. Well, if it had been anybody else calling since they got assaulted on our front porch and they knew who it was, they would have done been to jail. They would have went to jail that night. They was wanting to take somebody to jail that night till I told them who it was. You can do whatever you want to do. The Logan County attorney also tells me they received a full investigation report from the Kentucky State Police in July. Now, the attorney has requested a special judge and special prosecutor to make a final decision on whether to charge the sheriff. Right now, there are no pending charges. Reporting in the studio, I'm Amanda Chen, Fox 17 News, your Code Red Station.